but hey guys so if anyone doesn't know my name <laughs> it's um nechama marilis uh or nina go by both um but so i'm gonna do a q a based on questions that you guys asked me i have it written down because i write everything okay so what is something that bothers you <laughs> um something that bothers me honestly makeup <laughs> Um, I actually had a photo shoot, so I kind of, I used makeup. I don't usually wear makeup, but something that bothers me is when people think they're right about everything because, you know, like, no one could ever be right about everything. It's just not how life goes. Um, another one, what do you eat on a daily basis? So, I used to be, um, like, full vegan. Um, sorry, I'm, like, in an awkward position. Okay, so, I used to be, sorry, my hair is bothering me, um, I used to be full vegan, right, and then I decided that I should not, so now I eat fish and eggs, they're back in my diet, but I don't eat meat or dairy, so no meat or dairy, honestly, like, on a daily basis, breakfast, like, I'll eat two hard-boiled eggs and, like, a vegetable, lunch, like, a salad, just like very healthy I just feel so much better that way okay um what is my workout schedule I work out every day cardio every day <laughs> no matter what like actually no I do take a break once a week because your body does need a break like so your muscles can relax themselves so they don't get fatigued or anything um and yeah so and then I do like I work on either one or two body parts um every day so yeah <laughs> um and i switch it up a lot because you have to really shock your body so um so that it like changes and whatever sorry my voice is like this also like i have a cold <laughs> um but okay next oh this is for my friend she wants to know if i like chunky peanut butter or smooth peanut butter the answer is smooth <laughs> okay um if you can be someone else for a day who would it be so honestly i never really thought about that um but if i had to choose i would just choose someone that i could really learn from and like grow as a person like just like find things out that i never knew so yeah um i don't know like i've been pretty happy with myself like i never really thought about being someone else which is good thank god but yeah i don't know um okay this is for my friend also. <laughs> what do you do after you kill your friends in the gym? So my friends have been coming with me to the gym and I've honestly been like really working them out, but they've been so good. So shout out to them. Um, and what do I do after? I just kill the boy. <laughs> um, okay. What are my future dreams? So my future dreams, I honestly have a lot and you know, like People could, like, say, like, yeah, it's just a dream, but, like, you really have to, if you take action, honestly, anything is possible to anyone, not even just young people, anyone, honestly. Um, so, I'm very into fitness, if you all know. Um, <laughs> what else? I also, like, I'm very into, like, just positive thinking and just, like, you know, like, being in the moment and just, like, being so secure with yourself and being happy with who you are and who you're becoming, so I guess like motivational speaking also and the ultimate goal I'm not gonna say that now <laughs> but I do have a lot of goals for the future um, so another question how did you get so motivated at such a young age with fitness and just your mentality and your way of thinking so um, I happen to have gotten sick like a few years ago nothing that crazy but like I couldn't really work out or play sports or anything so I just kind of felt like gross so after like when I was finally feeling better I was in the gym and like um there's a lot more to like this story but um I was in the gym and I just kind of like loved it and like you just feel so good after and it's just like such a good feeling and you're working on your own self like I, di I didn't go to lose weight maybe at first I did and then like I realized like, oh, like I'm really making myself healthy and like, it's not just about losing weight, it's about feeling good and not even like, not even like looking wise, but like if you're healthy, like you just feel good and of course you're gonna look good, but um, 
also okay so my mentality my like my mental like of course like I have my days where like things are not going well because you know I'm human like everyone has their days um but I don't know you just kind of have to think positively and just like understand that everything happens for a reason because it truly does I truly do believe that and you know like everything that happens like sometimes you can look back and be like oh this happened for such a good reason like look where I am now so honestly just like be in the moment and appreciate where you are even if it's the hardest thing you're going through it's hard it's easier said than done but once you train your brain to think that way it kind of like gets used to it a little bit so it's a lot easier and now you guys know that I am young but you have to stay tuned for the next video to find out how old I am <laughs> so um do I have a middle name and what does it mean okay so I'm Jewish if none of you guys know um, so my name is Hebrew, my full name, Nechama, Ma uh, Nechama Bracha. It actually means a blessing of comfort. So Bracha is my middle name. There you go. <laughs> and yeah, people call me Nina, like if you can't pronounce my name or whatever. Um, what is something that keeps you going? So, like I said, we all have our days, like, sub like, like all the time. Like, you know, like, I'm just like anyone. I have my days where I'm like, oh, like, I can't do this, like, whatever, and, like, I just stop. But honestly, something that does keep me going is knowing that I'm not where I want to be yet. Like, the thought of that and, like, knowing that I can be better keeps me going. Like, knowing that I have stuff to work on keeps me going. And, like, I don't know. Just got to find your things and, like, find what you love and just, like, let it keep you going and just keep yourself going because you have a purpose and if you don't find it go and find it like it might take longer than others and that's okay but just keep looking um okay last place i traveled in the u.s was florida <laughs> um i just got back actually like two weeks ago it was really nice um family vacation <laughs> um and last question is how tall are you not tall <laughs> i am so i'm i mean like i'm not tiny but i'm pretty short um five okay so actually weird five four and a half is what i was then i went to the doctor recently and he told me that i grew like an inch so i'm like five five and a half now but i'm really short a lot of people think i'm taller some people think i'm short so yeah like <laughs> it's really funny um and i'll just answer one more question have you ever gotten any surgeries or work done the answer is absolutely not <laughs> nothing nothing against it at all just for myself like I'm very into like natural and just embracing like yourself and who you are and yeah so I never got work done the only thing on me that's fake is my eyelashes sometimes <laughs> and my eyebrows are real people have asked they are real um but God kind of had to bless me with them because when I was little I had a unibrow <laughs> and now they're nice so thank God for that but um, those are the questions that I decided to answer. If I didn't answer your question, I'm sorry, and you can let me know. But, uh, thank you guys so much, and stay tuned for my age and workout videos and a whole lot more. Um, and subscribe. Thanks. <laughs>